Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to my channel. Or welcome to my channel if you're new. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are going to be creating this graphic winged liner look. This is actually a graphic double wing. I knew I wanted to do something really graphic today, so I went on YouTube and I got some inspiration from MUA Ariana here on YouTube. I'll put her right here on the screen. She's super talented and she gave a really great video and a really pretty color combo, but I wanted to choose a color combo of my own. And she made it seem so easy. And I mean, hers came out even more flawless than mine, but um, it really helps. So if you guys want to watch that video, go ahead and down below and see where I got my inspiration from. But I knew I wanted to create some graphic double wing liner and yeah so if you guys want to see how i got this pink purple graphic wing liner look then please keep watching okay so to start off this whole double winged liner look i've already done my brows and prepped my eyes so i just put my concealer on um i think i'm going to set the concealer because i don't want it to crease with the eyeliner so i'm just going to take some of my maybelline fit me powder and just apply so that it's not creasing. Okay, so now it's set. So I'm going to start off by going in because I want to do pink and purple so I'm going to start off with the purple. So I'm going to go ahead and find the purple first. So I'm going to take the Glam Vice Cosmetics Retro Liner in Tie Dye and these are water activated. They are so pretty. So I have a cup of water here and I have the Glam Vice brush that it came with because I got a set. Um, and it's just a nice flat brush to kind of create nice wings. So I'm going to take the wet brush and kind of go in. And it'll look like this when it's wet. So now I'm going to go ahead and just take the liner and start applying. So I'm going to start by creating just a regular line. Like so. And then I'm going to drag that in this way. Like so. I'm going to do the same to the other side. Okay, so that is the purple part so I'm gonna wet the brush to get the purple out because next we're gonna go into pink um, also I think I want to clean up a little bit yeah I want to clean it up a little bit to make it a little bit thinner I'm gonna take my Kylie Cosmetics um, concealer in oak just because simply this is the only thing I have around me nothing special um, I'm gonna take a flat brush and just clean up So my brush is now cleaned off from the pink, the purple, and I'm going to go into the pink, which is Roller Skate. I've used this on my channel before. It's a really bright, like, corally pink, so I'm hoping that it gives me what I want. If not, that's fine. And I want to make sure that this is really, like, on the tip, because I want it to be a thinner line than the first one. Oh, 
so it created like a double line. Kind of like so. Can y'all see that? I don't know. It is a little thick for my liking, but I'll live, we'll live, I'll live. Um, I am gonna go back in with the purple for the first eye because I got some pink on there and we don't want that, but I think that's the beauty of these. Like you can literally go back and forth because you're just wetting the brush. So I'm going to go ahead and finish my face and then I'm going to come back and finish off the eyes with you guys. So we'll be right back. So my complexion is now done. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into the eyes and I'm going to take my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. I love these colors together. Oh my God, I feel like, like a cotton candy. Anyways, and I'm going to use that to apply my mascara. Oh, this looks really good. Okay, so next I'm going to go into my lips. So for my lips, I don't even know what I'm going to do. First, actually before the lips, because I think I have to get up and get my lip products, I'm going to um, emphasize my beauty marks by taking my e.l.f. liquid liner in jet black and just boop and boop. Kind of like so. You know, I don't know why I do it because, you know, we wear masks, but... I like to do it so and I just take this elf brush this is the 105 I really like this brush and I just kind of set it so that it looks natural I mean the beauty marks are natural on my face but like I, I just like to emphasize them because especially with wearing like full coverage makeup kind of covers them so I'm gonna let it set for a bit and while I'm doing that I'm gonna go and grab my lip products so that we can do the lips and finish this thing off off excess powder so we're not looking crazy I'm also gonna take a makeup wipe because for some reason today my lips are really dry and I don't know why that rhymed so I'm gonna take a makeup wipe and just wipe off the product on my lips because there's a lot <laughs> I'm gonna go into my NYX lip liner in the shade club hopper I really really like this one and I'm just gonna line my lips going to go into my elf camel concealer in shade medium sand i use this one for my lips and i'm gonna apply that just to the center to create a nice ombre hold on this look would not look bad with a purple lip mm. 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 i'm gonna stick with my ombre but next time we're doing a full purple lip, okay? We won't be scared. We're gonna do it together. Then I'm gonna go into my ColourPop. Um, it's their Luxe lipstick, I believe it's called. And this is in the shade Butter. It's like the perfect nude. I really like it. I'm gonna apply that over top in the center. It takes a lot of lipsticks to make my perfect nude, but we're almost there. I am going to go back into the lip liner to kind of emphasize it a bit more because sometimes it can get lost. Oh, I'm loving this. And lastly, I'm going to go into my Buxom Lip Plumper in the shade Pink Champagne. And I'm going to apply that to the center of my lips. I'm 
gorgeous <gasps> okay and lastly i'm gonna take my urban decay all nighter setting spray i have the mini one because it can last and i'm gonna set my face and i know there's been multiple intermissions and breaks throughout this video but i'm gonna go fix my hair and do my hair how i really want to do it and then i'm gonna come back okay so I'll be right back. You guys are going to see why I wanted to do this look, okay? So, I'll be right back. I had to put on the clips because I think they're so cute. I haven't worn them in so long. Um, so, yeah. That is it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel for more. And I will see you guys in the next one.